Do you want to learn how to burn something? Probably not this, though it is burnt. Um, something, something a little easier. I want to teach you how to burn this. I want, I want to teach you how to burn a cute little mushroom with lady beetles on it. So first step, learn how to draw this. Freeze frame, scribble it. These are your tools. You've got your straight hard line edges and you've got your round edges. Found myself a bit of wood. And now I just do a bit of magic. Wow! I sketched it on with a watercolour pencil. Now my tools are hot, let's start burning. I use my hard straight line edges to do all of my curved hard straight lines. This is the universal tool and I got my tool from Bunnings. Let's show you how the tool works. See that you hold it directly upright. If you hold it on an angle, you'll get your shading techniques like this. Just sort of push down and flick. Swapping to our round tool, I'm going to make myself some lady beetles. Circles and dots, that's all that was. I took this and made it into this. Girl princess. This is why we use the watercolour pencil. I can wash it out. Using reactivated watercolour paints, I start layering my colours. I want to go in with like a little bit of a yellow base because mushrooms have like a little bit of a funky colour. Oop, used too much water, had to fix that a little bit. Remember, control the water, control the stain. Now this is what's going to make it go, it's going to sizzle. I don't want it to go on too dark to start off with so I prep the board with a little bit of water and then I massage it in. That's how you get to blendy blendies, you got to massage it in. Be gentle. With the power of film, it is already dry. So we can do our next layer. I want to give it like a cottage core vibe. I want a vignette. Because I want it darker, I'm not going in with water, I'm going straight in with stain. And then I'm blending it out with water. Oh, enjoy this satisfying swirl. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I'm gonna do my shadows and make sure you finish off with your edges. Now here's the secret. Highlights. So I mixed up my lacquer and my highlight color, which is white so that when I put my lacquer over the top it doesn't all shift, you want it to be goopy and wonderful. After that I went in with my sharpie so that I could get my true blacks and she just needs to be sealed to be done. I had to move out here because chicken was a bit meepy. Chicken's my parrot. Anywho, so if you would like to do this that would be great and if you liked this video please hit the like button. Um, if you think that the mushrooms are cute, hit the like button. If you think that lady beetles are adorable, hit the like button. Um, subscribe?